Yo, what's going on guys? In this video, I'll be showing you three protective and tunnel style retakes that you can use in PG1v1s or just for clips. If you want to see more videos like this, do hit the sub button so that you don't miss out on the next one. And with all that said, let's get started. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the first retake in full speed, then I'm gonna break it down to you right after. Okay, now for this retake, you want to start off with double ramps just like this. What you want to make sure is that the top ramp is above this bottom ramp. Now place the floor, then two walls like this. Edit this floor, then place those two walls here. Now edit this wall here and place a floor in a cone. And this is even before you step out to give the enemy any type of angle on you. You want to do this while you're kind of still in this place here. Then place those two walls, a cone. Then from here you want to edit the cone and then quickly place a wall to catch it so that the cone doesn't break before you confirm this edit you want to confirm while you're in the air so you have to be in a running motion then place a floor and a stair just like that and make sure you're kind of close to the wall here so that you're not too exposed by the enemy now place a floor and a cone and from here edit that floor and place two high walls above you now place a stair floor and a stair drop down here then edit this floor with these two tiles here place two walls edit that wall like this now from here you want to place a floor in a cone and then you kind of want to do this all in one motion so floor cone then you quickly look to the right and place two walls and land on a stair just like this and now from here you want to make sure that you kind of land a little bit on top of the ramp you don't want to lay in here because then it'll mess up everything so you want to aim for it right here now from here you you turn around edit the floor edit the cone place a wall then edit the wall upwards then place two cones just like that and at the same time while doing all of that you want to jump and place these two walls and if the enemy's not here you can keep going on with any other type of retake if you wanted to and here's the retake again in full speed and this retake is really useful for changing direction and throwing off your opponent all right that's pretty much it for this one now let's go on to the next one Okay, now, so for this retail, you want to start off with a triple edit, just like this, edit two tiles, and then the one cone tile edit, just like this. Now, after doing that, you want to wrap around with three walls, actually four, because the one that's behind the stair right here. So that's four walls, just like this. Edit through the wall, place a stair, floor cone, edit this floor tile here, then place those high walls above you. Now you want to do this jump. And land on the floor place a floor above you and place a stair behind you for more protection now edit through this wall here place two stairs a floor two walls to block off this side now edit through the floor place two walls above here edit through the wall just like that and place a wall a stair and then a cone right above you if you want extra protection you can place a floor too and then after that edit through this and yeah that's it for this retake and here's how the retake would look like in full speed again and now let's move on to the next one. Okay, so now with this retail, you want to start off on a stair just like this and place a floor and a cone above you. Edit the two tiles of the floor, then edit the one tile of the cone. Then from here, you place two walls just like that. You can place this extra wall here and wrap around like this if you wanted to, but it's not necessary because you'll most likely be up here. But then again, if you want that extra protection, you can place this wall here too. Now edit through the wall, then place two stairs, a floor, then two walls to block off this side here. Edit through the floor, then edit through the wall just like this. And then from here, place another stair and place a floor and a cone. Now listen to this important part here. So edit the floor then edit the cone and place a wall and a cone right above you since you're already on the cone bind you can quickly reset this then place two walls just like that so this is how the scenario will work after you reset the cone you're gonna jump and as soon as you land you jump again to the side here place a wall and a stair then you'll be wrapping around like this you'll be wrapping around like that then from here you can edit through the wall place a stair floor and a cone again two walls to block off this side here then only edit the single tiles of the floor in a cone so you're going to edit the floor edit the cone and you're going to extend walls just like this so it'll look like this and then you place another stair above you for that full protection then you can edit through this wall here place a floor in a cone two walls in a cone and you can either edit off and go to this side here or you can do what i did in the video and just place the cone and 
go off on that side as well and yeah that's it for this retake here it is again in full speed now something you're going to realize with these retakes that i do is that i try to block off every angle that i know the enemy may have on me to give that full protection if you enjoyed watching this and you found this helpful comment sensational in the comment section and let me know which one is your favorite and yeah that's pretty much it for this one i'll catch you guys in the next video peace